I've done gymnastics my whole life and I have one more year of it, which hopefully it's my best year yet. Um, I am still in college. I'm a college kid. I'm on a team and I just want to keep it clean. Yeah, I really want my legacy to be spreading the word that you are more than your sport and you can have it all. People always say that's not hard. Yeah. What do you have to say to people that say that about gymnastics? Try it yourself, then, then talk to me. She did make her season debut in February with a 9.85 on the uneven bars. So in gymnastics, what event do you think you need the most energy for? I would say definitely floor. To Why? get through a routine is exhausting. First question is, how would you define the Olivia Dunn brand? I would say it's a little bit of everything. It's my lifestyle, it's fashion, it's fitness, friends and fun. Bringing new eyes to the sport is very cool, um, but when I'm in the gym with my teammates, it's strictly business. I put my phone away. I don't She made her elite debut in 2014 at the American Classic, where she finished 28th in the all-around. Then, she competed in the U.S. Classics, where she finished 12th in the all-around. The next year, at the WOGA Classics, she was placed 5th overall and qualified for the National Championships, where she finished at 25th. And she even managed to qualify for the national team in 2017. At her international debut, Livy finished 7th overall. By 2018, she'd made her senior elite debut and was allowed to compete in the national championships via petition. And started competing with the LSU Tigers gymnastics team in 2020. She was a part of the team when they placed second at the SEC Championships. The team finished fifth next season, but was eliminated in the one after that. Livy didn't compete in any events for much of the 2022-2023 season, claiming various injuries. This injury proved to be a turning point, shifting the trajectory of her elite gymnastics ambitions. She did make her season debut in February, with a 9.85 on the uneven bars. It's pretty clear that Livy's a serious gymnast, but is she good enough to be considered the face of female gymnastics?